This pin stitch is going to be in the shape of an L. It's just another form of pin stitch, and I have outlined a crescent stitch that I'm going to do. Now, you may have seen um, instruction to do an L stitch two times. One stitch horizontal and one stitch vertical. I always do a third stitch either over the horizontal or the vertical leg, just to make sure that my thread is very secure. Here's my L stitch. This is where I'm going to begin my crescent. I'm gonna pull up on this, snip it, and now I'm ready to stitch. An L stitch also makes a very flat anchor, which is good, um, especially for a stitch where you do not want to have a bump. Oh, I got out of line. I need to make sure I'm in line. Or my L, L stitch may not be properly covered, so let me just back that out, try again. If you are, again, uh, to determine where to place your pin stitch, always look at the final diagram of the stitch that you're doing to see where most of the threads are crossing each other because that will help you to determine where to put your pin stitch. I always try to put my pin stitch where it's going to be covered by most of the threads. I do not want my pin stitch to be in the stitching channel. That means in this line here or this line here because I do not want to mistake the pin stitch for a part of the stitch. And it's easy to get confused when you're doing something that's a little more complex like some of the twisty stitches. Okay, now this will finish up my little crescent that I'm doing. <clears throat> and I'll show you how to make an L stitch to end. Take your finger and pull the thread down out of the way. And I'm gonna put my L stitch right here. I'm going to try to get that little knot out. We'll just see if we can cope with it. Now, when you're ending with a pin stitch, it's okay to end with just two stitches. I always start by going three times over the thread. That's because there's going to be tension on that thread as I make the stitch. But after I've completed the stitch, there's no longer going to be any tension on the thread, so it's safe to start end it with just two stitches. So that's my L stitch.